But in many ways, Putin has already lost. Far from being the far-sighted manipulator of events that he would have us believe, Putin has damaged himself through a series of catastrophic misjudgments. He has failed to recognize how deeply the notions of sovereignty, democracy, and national identity have taken root in U re Ukraine. What is very clear is that Putin is a weaker and more diminished figure today than he was a month ago. And conversely, NATO is stronger and more united today than at any time I can remember. So one year on from the government's integrated review, my premise is threefold. First, the threat we face is much larger than the future of Ukraine, important though that is. We face a sustained attempt to challenge and undermine the international rules-based system here in Europe and elsewhere. Second, the British armed forces must be more active and engaged in the world, working with our partners in NATO and beyond to protect and advance the national interest and our shared democratic values. Third, this means defence has an even greater responsibility to deliver the integrated review, and we must work even harder to become an even more effective department.